Hey guys, it's Hillpop95. Welcome to uh, Pokemon Wi-Fi Battle 3. This is a double battle. Uh, me and my partner versus, yeah, two other players. And, okay, so we're gonna lead off with, uh, Swirl and Arcanine. I lead with Flygon, my partner leads with Electifier. Flippy is a copyright vice well What was he thinking? <laughs> he just goes for the endeavor. I'm like, okay, did you expect to go last? Arcanine uses Heat Wave. I'm like, not very effective, but not a little damage on my partner. I just earth power that Arcanine like it's nothing. Cause super effective damage mirror. Arcanine goes down. And even a critical hit, that had to have hurt. Electrovirus uses discharge. Yeah, we have some really good battle strategies in this video. Like discharge and ground type as their partner. Like it didn't even affect me and it was super effective on the swallow. So yeah. So he goes into the pottery, so that thing has a bolt absorber, like, no! And he goes in, and partner goes into Gartov. It's really hard to, uh, to commentate double battles, it's really tough. So I just go for the Dragon Claw on the Gartov, doesn't even do half. And then the Gartov uses Draco Meteor, but not on me on Electivire, so I'm like, oh my goodness, if it was on me, then I was like, definitely going down, because it's super effective. So what's the fire goes for the strength on the Pachirisu? Pachirisu actually takes that really nice. And he uses Super Bang! And only does 4 damage because it only did half. I just Dragon Claw again and... Don't knock it out, it's like 1 HP. And just use it and go to the Draco Mirror, but I dodge it. I'm like, oh my goodness. <laughs> like my heart my heart was pounding right there, I remember that. And I was like, please use Super Fang again, but just use Hyper Fang. Electivire goes down. My partner's Electivire goes down, I should say. He goes into his Scizor here, and I go for the Dragon Claw and finish off the Garchomp. Pachirisu uses Discharge, but it only affects, uh, Scizor here, because I'm a, because Flygon's a ground type. Doesn't even do much, even, and he goes for the Night Slash and knocks out the Pachirisu. Uh, he goes into the Bayonet, and his partner goes into the Gastrodon. And that Gastrodon actually ruins, like, our strategy that's about to come up. You'll see. So, I use Fly, because I'm Fly, John. Why not use Fly? Am I right? Scizor uses Night Slash on the Bayonet. One hit knockout right there. It's crazy. Even a critical hit. I don't know if it was going to knock out if it wasn't a critical hit, but I don't know, whatever. Gastron uses Muddy Water, but I'm in the air. And <laughs> Scizor avoids it. That was a crazy thing. I'm glad I went into the air. Even though it was doing normal damage. Scizor goes for the air slash, but Gastrodon dodges. Like, there's a ton of ga there's a ton of dodges in this video. Uh, Scizor dodges that muddy water, and Flygon doesn't. Well, it does decent damage. I just go for the uh, Dragon Claw right here, and my partner Scizor uses Night Slash. Doesn't go down, and Gastrodon uses Recover. We don't like to. So I'm like, okay, enough with this. Go, Jellison. <laughs> yep, my shiny Jellison. Oh yeah, found this thing about two months ago. Um, as this video has been uploaded, he goes into his pod wrap. This was another one of our strategies. Both of us have water absorbed, so we were going to spam surf. But then, I, but then I remembered that that Gastrodon has Storm Drain, so it won't even work. So I was like, yeah, we're just gonna have to use some other moves. Uh, he goes for the wake up slab. Doesn't do that much, but it really doesn't matter. I just ice beam it, and it lives. Gastron uses Sludge Within right here. Not very effective on my Jellicent. It doesn't even do much to Pyrath anyway, but I do get poisoned. Doesn't make 
too much of a difference, I guess, but, oh well. So I just return my gelatin because I'm like crazy here, and I go into my Gardevoir, which is back an energy ball. Like if you use your cover one more time, and we do four times effective energy ball you. I was gonna go for the energy ball in my way. He uses earthquake. I'm like, oh my goodness, he's trying earthquake. Uh, Polyrath just goes for the <laughs> wake up slap and just knocks it out. I'm like, dang it, I want this energy ball four times effective. It has like five hit points. Left. Oh well, at least we won. Uh, see you guys in the next video. Don't expect me to do many um double battles like this, cause. They are really tough to commentate. Like, I had to keep on talking and talking and talking. So don't expect many double battles or, in fact, triple battles or anything. I will do some more, but don't expect them all the time. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.